Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Gino Lamont. And I'm Elizabeth Bobian. A new way of testing what your kids are learning in school was proposed today by the state superintendent of schools. Tom Torlickson announced a new statewide testing system for K-12 through students here in California, and it's a radical change from what children had been doing. KMIR 6's Adriana Weingold joins us now with the details. Adriana. State Superintendent Torlickson made 12 recommendations to fundamentally change the state's assessment system. He wants to move away from the paper and pencil based star testing and replace it with a computerized system that would actually gauge whether or not a student understood what they were learning. Filling in the bubble may soon be a thing of the past for students in California. State Superintendent of Public Instruction Tom Torlickson says he's shifting the focus of standardized testing, more critical thinking, less memorization. We're moving to a newer dimension, uh, a much higher dimension, a smarter, more effective assessment and learning system with continuous improvement checkpoints built into it. Torlickson says the pencil to paper tests are a thing of the past. The new tests follow the guidelines of the Common Core state standards. At Palm Springs Unified, Director of Elementary Education Tony Knapp says he's encouraged by the new testing and says it will help get kids ready for life after school. We think this is a big movement uh, forward, uh, especially looking at career and college readiness that we want to see the students move towards. The new method moves students away from rogue memorization and instead tests if they actually understand what they've learned in the classroom. I think it's so very important that we make this shift and know that it's going to create uh, a much stronger learning environment within our classrooms and uh, help us get a much more accurate pulse on how well our students are performing in course subjects. The existing STAR testing is scheduled to end in July of 2014. The new testing system will begin in the 2014-2015 school year. Torlickson also says this new way of testing will allow teachers to get results mid-year so they'll be able to shift their curriculum to better meet the needs of students. Back to you. All right.